most of our clothing is made out of this cotton ball. Can you believe that? Cotton, a regular cotton ball. Our clothes is made out of cotton. Now guess what? In order for this cotton ball to become something that we can wear, it must go to a factory where it is stretched and pulled and stretched and pull and made into long, sh long strings. Then it's weaved together, just like we made our Kwanzaa mats, weaved up and down and up and down into cloth. Then cloth is how we get our clothes. Almost, but it's up and down and up and down. Now some of us have on cotton shirts that are not white. And I know that the cotton plant is white. Now, how can we make different co We dye them. They can be printed. They can be printed. Or they can be thin out. They can be changed into different colors by thin out. Or you could dye them. They can be changed into different colors by dyeing them, by adding a color. We're going to take our cotton balls and we are going to put it inside of our waters and make sure it gets saturated nice and wet. Use those fingers, push it down. Make sure it gets nice and wet. Push it all the way down. Your fingers will get wet. That's okay. We can wash them off. I'm gonna pass out a piece of paper that you are gonna use to record what you just did. You will be able to draw a picture that showed what you did in your experiment. What did you observe in your experiment? Once I give you your paper, you may start drawing. What's that right there? Let me reward my friends for sitting beautifully. I think I promised Bailey a stamp for sitting beautifully. Good job.